Hi Scorpio, welcome to your energy reading for the beginning of May 2022. This reading uh, is one of the first readings that I've learned when I was in witchcraft school, when I was getting my witchcraft diploma. So on the table we have 15 jumper cards which are supposed to be read telling in, in one um, unique sentence telling the whole story, the whole situation, or three sentences that are linking the whole story. In case you're wondering, this is the Tarot Familiars from Lisa Parker. And if you are seeing some glare, I apologize. But it is a slippery, shiny tarot deck, but it's very beautiful, especially if you like familiars, especially if you are a, a witch. So without further ado, Scorpio, let's jump right into it. A masculine energy or a man that doesn't know how to express his feelings. He has a lot of feelings, right? But he doesn't know how to express them, how to communicate. So this masculine energy that doesn't know how to communicate very very naive keeps holding on to their vision trying to manifest an offer that was never accepted some toxic situation or some unhealthy habit, some unhealthy relationship which doesn't have balance or someone feels breadcrumbed and stressed, blocked in their minds, overthinking. And then karma hits the one that broke someone's heart and healing or wishes brings happiness and love and an offer shows the way to the heart which it is which is a, a loving offer that shows the path to the heart and then something quickly changes and all the burdens are put down and the outcome is someone or yourself finding yourself or themselves like a child that has a lot of passion, a lot of intention to learn, to succeed, to advance. Very innocently with the eyes of looking at the word as something brand new. In your head, you have things that are moving very fast, struggles. You're not being able to adapt or you are afraid that you will not be able to adapt to all these changes that are presenting around you. Or maybe this is just a feeling, right? This is what is in your head in the bottom of the deck. So we have here a masculine energy that could be you, that can be someone that you're dealing with. Or maybe someone that is vibrating so much in their masculine energy that the feminine energy of love and feelings doesn't get to the to the surface to express themselves, right? And the naivety of holding on to a vision, to a manifestation of an offer that was never accepted. Something toxic or someone toxic that doesn't have any balance 
or any generosity or that breadcrumbs the other person. It's stuck in the thoughts in their head, overthinking, stressing, losing uh, nights of sleep. And then karma hits, especially for the one that broke someone's heart. And this is healing or wishes that bring happiness in love. Showing an offer that leads to the heart. Things change fast, the burdens are put down, and you feel, again, young and ready to take a path with renewed hope we renewed power to advance and in your head fast changes difficult fast changes that you are afraid of or you are facing or you will face This is what I have for you, Scorpio. I hope I have helped you in some way, shape or form. Thank you for sharing your time with me and see you next time. Bye-bye.